Start walking up 4th Street, keeping the safe way on your right and 4th Street on your left. The metro stop should be behind you. Up ahead, you'll see a CVS. Before I moved here, I would visit my grandparents in this very neighborhood every year until they passed away in 1989 when I was, well, you don't need to know how old I am. <laughs> Next, and this is important, we're going to be walking through the neighborhood. We will cross streets at times. Please observe all pedestrian signs. Also, I'll suggest that you take a seat at points along the way. These are merely suggestions. Don't put yourself in any harm. If you ever need to stop for something, pause the tour because the audio is synced to a walking piece. Oh, and we will pass one or two construction sites. Like the one coming up ahead of us. Stay alert. Actually, the story of this tour really comes out of buildings and construction and how we improve neighborhoods. This process of improvement is always happening in every city, on almost every block, at any time. But we never really stop and think, for whom is the improvement being made? And what needs to become better? And how are we involved in this improvement? You should be past the CVS now and passing that new building that is under construction or just completed. On your left hand side across the street, you should see a beauty salon. It's got a neon blue sign. Just note how it looks and keep walking. Stop when you are just past the building under construction. Imani has something to show you there. Are you past the new building? To your right should be a small walkway. We're going to take that walkway in a moment, but for now you should be stopped. Take out your phone to look at the image Owen took of the ideal barber shop. Compare the salon you saw to this barber shop. At the ideal barber shop, you didn't have to get a haircut to get the news and debate the issues of the day. And in the spring of 1952, Southwest's redevelopment was the big issue of the day. Now turn down that path and walk away from 4th Street. The new building should be on your right, and a church is on your left. I can imagine stepping into the ideal barber shop on one of those spring days. Here he is, right here. Joseph Owen. Tell this man he better stick to cutting hair, because he ain't got the slightest idea what he's talking about. All I said was it doesn't make any sense for them to tear down everything in Southwest when all of Southwest ain't Dixon Court. Tell them to tear down Dixon Court. Dixon's Court was a notoriously unkempt alley near here. You should see a crosswalk up ahead. You're going to cross that crosswalk. Then where are the people going to go? Anywhere would be better than that. You think once them bulldozers get ahead of steam, they're gonna stop at Dixon Court? Joseph Owen, tell this knucklehead about that plan. What was that man's name done come down to the library last fall? Uh, Peterson or something like that? Pete. That's it, so tell Eggie here about that plan. Man, I don't want to hear nothing about no plan or promises them folks done told you. I'm afraid they have moved on from the Pete's plan. What's that mean? What they doing now? They're gonna tear it all down. All of it, huh? You got to be kidding me. Wish I was. Told you. This ain't no redevelopment plan. This an eviction plan. Seems so. We all might as well kiss Southwest goodbye. That can't be so. Seems it is. 
You should be on the other side of the crosswalk now, and right in front of you will be the entrance to the library. It's a new building with a zigzag roof. Did you get there? Pause the tour if you need more time and press play when you're at the library doors. <laughs>